Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to talk about what the heck canvas box is, how does it work, how does it connect with the wiring harness and to your car stereo. Let's get into it. Okay, let's start talking first about the different makes, the different canvas boxes we have here. I have a few of them, the most popular one. You might have a different one, but uh, those I have here, they are the most popular canvas boxes. The first one I want to start with, it's the most popular one. It looks like this. That's the, the name of this canvas is Rice. So you, you can see it sometimes like RZ on the canvas box or it can say Rice at the back. This one doesn't say it, but the design with this one here like processor it's that's rice here we have another one O D O and D you can see it as a different names into the car stereos when you go and start set it up but O D is this one it's most popular when you have uh, Audi BMW and Mercedes you can meet it there very often with rice you can meet it most with uh, Volkswagen uh, Ford and other brands we have high world here it says high world on it so basically the easiest way to find which canvas box you have is by searching the name on it but the different design can help you find out for example high world and audi they're very very similar but it's still some difference in this holes here that's for the cooling we have simple here as well you can know it from the logo you can see the logo here on the top left corner and here is the one that's more difficult to find out because it doesn't say the brand on it and it's very similar to the simple canvas box because it's same color but it don't have the logo here that, that's the difference that's Wujen it's called Wujen you can see it uh, later on the la later in the video when I start showing you how to set up the canvas box. So yeah, that's Wujen. It's exactly the same as the simple, but doesn't have the logo. That's the difference. So when you start installing the car stereo, if you don't connect your canvas to the wiring harness the car stereo will not turn on it will not power on so make sure that the canvas is properly connected to your wiring harness because otherwise the stereo will not work here on every wiring harness that use canvas you can see this plug from the wiring harness it's the same from the canvas so just make sure you connect it. Be careful to don't break the pins because if you break them, it will not work. Carefully connect it like this. And that's it. So next step, that's Volkswagen wiring harness. Make sure that these two cables, the red and the orange one, they're disconnected because it will drain your battery. If you leave it connected, it will drain your battery and the stereo will not work with the key, with the ignition. Make sure that the canvas is connected properly and those two are disconnected. That's only with the Volkswagen, Seat and Škoda vehicles and car stereos and that's before two, that, that's manufacturer year of the vehicle before 2015 with all other cars or most of the cars you might need to connect these two together because 
they are connected with the canvas but here they are not connected to the canvas that's wife power from your car from the main adapter coming to the car stereo and the stereo will be on all the time you don't want this leave it disconnected and the canvas will do the job for you next thing next part when you connect the stereo i'll show you how to connect it now the most important part after you connect the main power to the car stereo is to connect this small connector with two cables on it doesn't matter what car make you have and what stereo you use you have this in 100% every time when you use canvas when the wiring harness have canvas so make sure you connect it properly to the back of the stereo like this because if you don't connect it even the canvas is set up properly your steering wheel buttons will not work and also it will not show the original car settings and functions like when you open the doors the AC info or like uh, sport mode or echo mode or any information the car sends to the canvas and to the car stereo will not work only if you don't connect this one so make sure this one is connected it should look like this and then when you connect them make sure you connect properly the main adapter from the wiring harness to the main adapter from the original vehicle after you connect it switch on the ignition and see if the stereo will turn on if it doesn't turn on it means that you might blow the fuse or it might be some other problems like you might have uh, any cut wire on the original wiring harness but all the systems they are properly tested they passed quality control test always before to be sent to the customer so it will always work and will never be a problem of the wiring harness of the canvas or the stereo if the stereo doesn't turn on after all the steps made properly next step i'm going to show you how to properly set up the canvas if for some reason the stereo buttons are not working or you don't see car information on your new car stereo okay so now to set up the canvas properly go to the main menu here you have all the apps car settings system settings factory settings again factory settings here you have password depends of which brand car stereo you use you have a different password and the factory settings it will be located in different place so that's a plus center car stereo this is how you set it up with the password 1617-6699 confirm and you're in the factory settings swipe down can type set again can type set and here you are provider that's your canvas name as i as i explained you earlier i'll show you now which one when to choose that's rice you choose rice from here that's audi here it is high world that's Wuzhen and simple I'm going to show you how to set up this one because this is the one we talked about the Volkswagen one how to set it up properly so you have no problems with it basically 
doesn't matter if you have Skoda, Seat or Volkswagen, if you choose the same model, the, if you choose model produced the same year as your vehicle. For example, you have Volkswagen Passat, yeah, you have it here. You have 5th generation, 6th and 7th and 8th. With this cable, that's before 2015, as I explained, this one should be disconnected. You might have B6 you have, and B6 and B7 Passat 6th or 7th generation. So, doesn't matter if you have Golf 5 or Golf 6, even if you choose Passat 6th generation, it will work. If you choose Passat 7th generation, it will work as well. It's same, for example, if you have Passat and if you choose Golf. Of course, if you have your model here, you can use it, but sometimes you might have some problems. Let's say the car information is wrong or something is wrong. What you can do is you can try just with a different model, same make, different model, same year. Just try, just try them, all of them, till you find the right one that works best with your vehicle. Because sometimes if you have, for example, uh, Golf Mark 6, let's say uh, 2 liter diesel, 4 motion. Okay, but do you know that the computer this vehicle is using, it's different. They, they have 15, 20 different variations in computer exactly same car exactly same year exactly same engine exactly same gearbox but the computer is different so you might have golf mark 6 but the canvas might best work with passat b7 let's say doesn't matter doesn't matter if you have golf or passat or tuareg or something else here let's say they are different model, Jetta or doesn't matter if you have Škoda Octavia Mark II or Golf 6 or Passat B6 or Seat Ibiza or Seat Leon if you choose the same year of this vehicle the canvas will work it's same with all other brands of the vehicles all other canvas boxes for example Nissan and Renault they use exactly the same wiring harness so you can use Nissan in some cases for example if you have uh, let's say simple again you, you have uh, a Renault Master okay but you can go to Nissan let's say uh, Navara 2017 is the same it will work. It might not work even with Renault, but work with Nissan because the computer and the wiring harness you use, they are produced by Nissan. Doesn't matter if you have a Renault, and doesn't matter if your model or brand of the vehicle is different than the one you use in the settings. So make sure you know which wiring harness are produced from which company. And yeah, for example, when, when you choose, le, le, let's come back. You have Golf Mark 6, yeah? You choose Golf Mark 6. Okay, after you choose it, press O. Just wait for it. After you see this page, the canvas is already set up. So now, what you can do is, you can try your steering wheel buttons, if they work or not. If they work, most of the cases, you're ready, you don't have to do anything else. Sometimes, when you open the front or the back doors, it might show the wrong door. How to change this? Go to main menu. Go to my car. Settings. Door window settings. For example, if you want to swap the front doors, press F door exchange, then confirm. And that's it. 
when you set up the canvas and you want to see your original car information go to menu apps car info and here you can see all the different settings for your vehicle you can change many settings you can do all things you can have on your original stereo the original car stereo even you might have more features you don't you didn't know that your car can do but yeah that's the main way and the main solution with the canvas boxes i hope that this video was helpful for you if yes please like the video if you want to see more videos like this please subscribe to our channel and yeah thank you and see you next time bye